crashed. God damn it. Or uh, it won't press buttons. Steven Nixplit. Tell me to buy this. Well, it, Xplit is really no, good. No, it's actually, I don't know why it's crashing. This patch, this patch. Oh, it was it. this patch on yeah, it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I think it's the third time it crashes. It crashed again. Let me see. Yeah, see, it still shows zero, zero. One station from there. What's it? No, I'm four. SVM did beat me, but it was ridiculously close. What's that? Yeah, I beat him. I beat him to go to keep going. It's just this guy, neither of us could deal with each other's pressure. So if I got the hit, I got his life bar. But if he got the hit, he got my life bar. So it kept going back and forth. It was nuts. But yeah, it was close. I almost took it. It was one, two. So. Yeah. All right, guys. So, guys, once again, let us know if the stream is still working. Please comment, comment, somebody comment. Like, right, comment, we should, and subscribe. We should just restart it. I think we should just restart. I would. I want to see what they say first. Because well, I mean, this. Please, is still people, be reply. On. Oh, it's caps lock. Yo! Oh, there you okay, go. Okay, they told me to stream more. Seems All right. Perfect. It's just, yeah, so any of you that want to use XSplit or are using XSplit, it's an amazing program. Just for some reason, this most recent patch, it's sometimes the buttons that sway, that tw changes from, like, the camera to the game to, like, the commentators and sponsorship, whatever, <laughs> it looks doesn't clean work. But <laughs> it, it just it decides to not have the buttons work. So we can't switch it's the It's weird, cameras. so we can't put, like, cameras or anything. But we're just paranoid that when that happens, the game actually Damn, freezes. dude. He's going with Aganos. All right. SVM wants to get that team sponsorship. He's helping you guys out. <laughs> Yeah, I'm the trader. He's actually teaching us quite a bit. Yeah, I'm the trader here. I'm the one that left PDF to, to make PDF. Go away. I'm the team captain of PDF. Go away. <laughs> now welcome here. Right. Well, I told you why I did it. Right. It's cool. It's cool. No, yeah. don't worry. Don't worry. Like, I, cause I made that. You, you saw that wallpaper I made, right? It's too good. And I'm like, six of the eight people are TGZ. <laughs> need some changes. We, we need to have a little bit of variety within the brackets. Yes, Aganos will fight. I don't know if he will win. The dream will come true. Ah, Alejandro doesn't know anything about Aganos. I think this is going to go wrong. The dream is... Bloody Sip and his counter picks, dude. Yeah. The dream... Oh, shit. We haven't changed the names. Fuck. We're bad. We're super bad. Uh, no, leave it. Leave it. Bloody Sip is fine. No, because... No, oh, you're right. Fuck. Bloody Sip and TGZ, baby. Baby. Sorry, guys. That's the final. There we go. So yeah. Oh, I need to put the winners and losers for people. Oh, this is grand finals, by the way. This is uh, pretty much to conclude our stream tonight. Yes. Damn the rock. This is gonna be really That's rough. Fun. But yeah, the dream, in my opinion, is your brother takes it. Maybe we take it. That's the dream. That's the dream. He has to win. Because he has played his heart out all the time we're here, but I don't think he's actually won one yet. A Rambats or do you mean the whole season? Uh, the what? Uh, eight Rambat. He's oh. always gotten second. Like me. <laughs> anyway, enough about that. Just a little bit of build up for what's going on here. Cause Oh, nice. that was a good nice. call. That was good to make a save. And he doesn't break it. Oh, yo. The damage. The comebacks are oh. real. Nice jump. That was gonna hit a good hit. Punish. Oh shit. Okay, good tag. Oh, he has a rock. Oh, shit. That was good. That was good. Again, he was in the air, so the rocks didn't actually matter. Good to know. And the grenade didn't matter neither. Nice grab. Oh! Goes for the grab. Evens that up. But yeah, we actually... This is three out of five, just so you know, guys. All right? But yeah, we do actually have a good Agonos player. That's amazing. He used to play Cinder, but I guess he found some crazy tech. I do like how he constantly goes for only two rocks. Because the more rocks you have, the slower you end up being. Oh, really? Yeah, like so normal. So that's why he doesn't get more? Yeah, so it's a nice, like, buffer. He's smart. Oh, and he baits it. Yep. 
Oh. Those lights are working. Oh, what? Whoa, 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 whoa. How was he able to get into a combo? Uh, because he was hitting the button. Or no, I'm actually, I don't know. Maybe he, he was light? jumping. Because uh, if you jump, you're still vulnerable for a couple of frames. And it's still considered jump. Whoa, whoa. You know your ground. Shadow. <gasps> oh, no. It was the right call, but the wrong spacing. That hurts. Nope. That's what? Is that game? No, it's not game. But he's going to get a bunch of armor, and now there's the corners right there. Get away. Yeah, he needs to not hit a button. Okay. Oh! I hope you guys enjoy my bias commentary. I want Baby to win so bad. <laughs> High low? Okay, so two hits. I was actually, yeah. Yeah, I, I might not be part of Team TGZ, but the loyalty doesn't yeah, go away, Yeah, no, you got it, dude. <laughs> it's fine. Just win. Win this Rembrandt. I'll do it. And you'll become TGZ again. <laughs> oh, right. Stop rooting for Aganos, stream. No Aganos. No. <laughs> He's back. This is the best Aganos I've ever seen. I actually beat Sir Killer online. Online? <laughs> yeah. He's good? Uh, he probably is. It's just that Sadira bullshit happened. It's really easy for Sadira bullshit to happen in this game. <laughs> oh, he's getting rocked right now. No pun there intended. Go, no. Oh. DP. DP. He was in the air. Oh, this is looking bad right now. But then again, he brought it back last time. That did not work. He has two armor. Nice cancel. Yeah. He can just he can do pull that, it through yeah. his way. He knows how to use armor. Damn. Talking about matchup that we don't know. <laughs> yeah, he's the only Aganos player that like comes here and that I know really. And it sucks that he went to call it or moved to call it, so this is the one time we'll see him. You think he's not coming back? He wants to, but he lives two hours away. That's kind of tough. I mean, yeah. two is on comes. That's an hour. Okay, that was a good way to get rid of that armor. Now it's in. Yes. There you go. Now some damage. I honestly did not get the bias coming. Ooh, Break that was it. good. And recapture the M. And mag damage. Actually, not as big as I thought it would be. Oh yeah, it's really good. The armor is right. Oh, Rick. Fuck. What? Instant. That was good. That was not. That was not good. He has armor. Oh, he just styling now. Didn't it? Didn't Ultra just threw? <laughs> <laughs> Two zero. Supreme victory. Good thing that he has six matches to adjust. Yes. Oh, is he switching? Nah. <laughs> Taking a minute. Is he actually switching? He might. I think he's thinking about it. Because I know that he has a, a pocket Jago. Yeah. It's you're not right. your Jago, but he's still a he decent Jago, one. Yeah. Uh, Street Fighter Jago. happens after this. Um, Running a little bit late, guys, but it's probably gonna start a fight. Mortal Kombat and Kia. Mortal Kombat and Kia. Alright, well, I'm just gonna solo commentate for a minute. Yeah, I'm gonna be a biased commentator, but for the non biasedness, you're right. Bloody Zip is an amazing Aganos. Like, I'm happy you guys enjoy watching it. Alright. So he has switched to Jago. I'm not sure of this choice. He still didn't DP. Oh! He's gonna get rocked. Yeah, I don't think he realized he can just flick the fireball away. And he's gonna just rock up. Oh, you're gonna join me, Rob? Ah, uh, sure, why not? We got PDF in the house now. Oh, yeah. Yes, God saw him, PDF Macho Punk. Well, not only that, we had a PDF uh, Dragon Ninja over there uh, rolling with the MKX uh, commentary pretty much the entire time. For a game he doesn't play, yeah. <laughs> I was even on there for a period of time. I don't play that game. Oh, that was such a bad DP. Yes. 
Yeah, considering he's in winners, like, he can feel it out and see what he wants to do. This was a bad choice. I feel like he was trying to go for fireballs to break the armor, but he didn't realize a flick breaks fireballs. Yes. So... Uh, he cannot... He cannot focus around Zony. Yeah, no, not with Agnos. Yeah. Agnos is pretty good at it. I won't say... I won't say he like I won't say he'd be even a Fulgore kind of counter. That, that won't work. Bad. <laughs> that choice. Oh, that the pain! Was such a good call. The pain. I didn't even think of doing that while he's stunned in that uh, super or that shadow move. Yeah. Oh, you take a little bit of armor, nope. but just go right through. Oh, don't, that's don't. it. It's really really hard to. It's really hard to figure out where you need to be with um against Agonos because not only if he has armor you can't really be right up on him because yeah. he can just grab you yeah you have to really space it and his normals like they're decent yeah um, but yeah you have to really space him out and just kind of poke okay. at his armor until he doesn't have any then never let up because his buttons suck when he has no armor it's just when he does they're amazing now when he does have the armor he does walk slower and move slower it's just the aspect that you have to uh, it's 3L reset. Yeah. And and w with the aspect of, you know, that armor being there, it's like, I'm in close. I hit you, took a little bit of armor. Oh, I'm just going to grab. Yeah. Grab, grab. And you see you see Bloody Ziv doing that every single time. And he will just grab you and take that damage. Yeah, and he just, you know, ignores Oki and instead just gives himself an extra rock so he can do it again. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, he's really thinking right now about what to do. Well, he dabbled, uh, Bebu always dabbled in Django to begin with. Yeah. I know he dabbled, dabbled a little bit in Fulgore, but then again, if, if he decides to play a zoning game again, that's not going to work. He just needs the space, he just needs the space and whiff punish with Orchid. That's his main, he knows how to whiff punish, he just needs yeah. to do that. And uh, he, he needs to play a patient long game, which he's not the best at. <laughs> This is very true, and I mean, if anything, if he decided to go into like a Fulgore or something like that, get himself into some shat uh, into some shadow moves and do the shadow teleport to get behind Agados. Yeah. And maybe try to take some of the armor that way. Is he going to do that? I, are we going to see a Fulgore? I, he's played Fulgore against me before. Right. Worked in his favor heavily. Then again, that, then again. That's what happens when you don't know how to play against Fulgore. Ooh. Yeah. Looks like we're getting the Fulgore. We're going to get the Fugbot out here. Going into Grand Finals. The resets happen. We're going to see if uh, we to see if uh, Beibu here can uh, make, the adjustment. make the adjustment needed and change the momentum that Bloody Ziff massively He's took. He's established <laughs> He's with a character has no momentum. Like, that's saying something. If you can establish momentum with Agnos, no amount of biased commentary that I have is going to disprove <laughs> how good Bloody Zip is right now. <laughs> oh, there's no need for biased commentary. Oh, I'm being biased as fuck because I want Beibu to win it. <laughs> <laughs> Did Bloody knock you out? Uh, no, he didn't knock me out. He didn't lose. Oh! It's still 0 0. It's still 0 0. Yeah. That's oh, ooh, good. Dirty cross up. Dirty cross ups. Now he's oh, all rocked up and he's good to go. Oh, shit. This is what. Oh, and now he can't get. He can't get out now. No, he's he screwed. can't. He's it's like, are you trapped in here with me or am I trapped in here with you? Yeah. This is looking free right now. Yes. I don't want to say that. that. It, it is looking very free at the moment. Um, there's got to be an adjustment here. He has. Nope. He has the meter to, to potentially take away the armor. There's also so many jump-ins that he's not punishing. And be a little bit more tricky with that teleport. Don't just go for the behind. Nope. He can't get behind that. I don't think he realizes that. See, okay, it, it worked a little bang. bit. It worked a little bit there, but the, he's only going for the behind teleport. He needs to kind of mix it up with either teleporting in place or teleporting yeah. almost in front to kind of mix him up and you know, weird him out a little bit about it. Yeah. See, that's not a bad idea. That, that was a good one. There you go. Nope. 
Yeah, it's really funny. Agnos looks like he's doing good right now, but that's because of Bloody Ziff, not because the character is good. The character is really hard. He is a good Supreme character, but yeah. he's really hard to be good with. Uh, and that's just a testament to Bloody Ziff's, you know, time that he's put into learning well, almost character. all the characters. Oh yeah, he, he has as much, time, as much knowledge of all the characters like uh, Boss Wolf does. Yeah, like they play every character in this cast. The there's uh, a reason why I call the two of them the men with a thousand characters. Yeah, pretty much. They're both Flow. EG, or not EG anymore, but Flow. All right, now he's going back to his main. This right, is what I want. Yeah. He needs to whiff punish. Your standing fierce is amazing with Orchid. No. Especially with Agnos' slowness. Just fucking out flitzy him. And your walk speed's amazing. Not that way. Don't. <laughs> don't. Uh, I know you want the armor gone, but take it with the grenade. He can't flick that. That's true. That is actually a good idea. It's Alejandro, or Bebu's playstyle is so rushed down. He wants to be in your face, and he loves playing that way. Agonos punishes that severely. And that's why I think he's like deer in headlights right now. He does not. He doesn't really know what to do. Like right there would be perfect for an anti-air. Doesn't give you good damage, but it's, it's guaranteed damage and it's not armor. Yeah. You got but big damage when there. he gets in for damage, there he you knows go. what he's doing. Now that he has it without armor, he's definitely show, uh, taking full advantage of that. Yes. And this is what we were talking about. Oh, that was a good call. Back over there. I wouldn't have put him out of the corner, but whatever. Oh, he's going to get armor now. Oh, yes. Oh, he's going to put himself back in the corner. There you go! That's what I've been talking about. Oh, shit. I don't know that move had armor with it, too. Good yes. call. This is what I'm talking about. He should have just stayed with Orchid at the time. He would have figured it out eventually. Yeah. That's that's the problem with counterpicking, in my opinion, is that you get so caught up in this character will do better, this character will do better, this character will do better, instead of learning how to play against the character, you know? Yes. And, and the only time that you can truly counterpick is when you truly have a, oh, a great aspect and knowledge of that character that you're about to play. Yeah. So if you have good knowledge of both ca of multiple characters, then it then the counter picking works. But if you don't, the counter pick is gonna do you nothing. Exactly. Exactly. Oh no. This is why. There we go. Oh, didn't have as much invincibility as I remember. Fuck. No, they toned down the invincibility. Bad call. He's, he, there's a chance he might let Blaze Zip pull this one out. All that armor. That oh god! Oh! Now it's all even again. Okay. That's a bad no, call. No bad he's call. Done. He's done. Oh yeah, he's done. Well Much played. Much closer. I keep on like talking uh, Babu's race and you know greatness, quote unquote, because I know he's a great player. It's just yeah. it looks so like it looks one-sided right now. And in, in, in this case, it is very one-sided. So I'm sorry for my biased commentary. I'm going to apologize. I keep joking about it because I know it is. I actually, at one point I did hate the shit out of Bloody Zip, and now we're actually good friends again, so I know that now I'm not doing it because I hate him, I just do it because I really want Beibu to win. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, clutch Agonos, though. Always. Agonos can be clutch. There you go. So good that, start. See? Whiff punish. <laughs> I think I just... Well, that's not bias. That's just like you you see that and you want to see it happen. Yeah. I think it's just all the Street Fighter I play. I understand just you don't always have to just go for big damage. Just get the pokes occasionally and yeah. do it. Oh. I mean, he took two rocks from there, but he's going to get him back. And, oh, my God. The damage. The walls. The walls. Break the walls down, everyone. Take him down. Oh, he that could have been a thing. That was not a thing, though. It's, uh, he gets armor as soon as he does Shadow Punch. Yeah, someone uh, take this footage and give it to Keats so he can go, see, this character isn't bad. <laughs> I know this isn't bad. Keats doesn't think this guy's bad. No, I'm just saying so he can show it to other people saying, see, yeah. he's not bad. Like Keats saying it's not bad. Keats loves Aganos. No, Aganos is probably, I, I won't lie, Aganos is probably one of their better designed characters. I agree. Just in terms of look, feel, oh, and armor. Oh, Just nice break overall though. fun factor to play. He's going for all these Oki setups, not thinking about the arm. Good break, good break. We got somebody calling him. This go. is over. This ain't over yet. And I know I used a bad word there because it's not actually a word, but screw it. <laughs> See, two raw jumps. Easiest to DP and make him stop. Oh, that's going to be big damage. 
All the air tires. Where do we have? Where are they at? Oh, <laughs> I was thinking he's gonna trap them. Style. He's in style mode now. There we go. Oh, he blew it out. He he blew it out because of the cat. Yeah. Okay, got nope. rid of the rock, but that's not gonna stop him from getting the throw. Got very little. Nope. Okay, you won't have to worry about. You can only hold so long. Oh, he, he can't over. take any more chips. This, this is, is done. Yeah. Yeah, this is done. So a 3-0 reset, 3-0. Wow. Damn. Well played by Bloody Ziff. Good job by both guys getting to uh, to the end here in this tournament. Yeah. Damn. But well, Bloody Ziff just going off the show. I, we saw, I saw him earlier today. I saw him earlier today playing uh, Cinder against SVM. Uh, he well, played Cinder against me. Like, he is versed in multiple characters. Damn. Well played. All right. Well, that wraps it up for KI for today. Um, if you guys want more KI action, that's two weeks from now. Yes. Uh, so same time, uh, starting at 1 uh, Arizona time, because daylight savings is weird since we don't have it here in Arizona. Yep. Um, no daylight savings time here, people. we Street Fighter starting now. I believe it's – I'm not sure if it's streamed yet. It's not on stream yet. They're starting the – they're getting some of the matches set up.